back. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. My name is Dami J and in today's video we are going to do a DIY with Dami. Yeah! Christmas is coming up and I'm going to do this super cute like Candyland sugar rush kind of theme for my Christmas tree. Honestly for all of my Christmas decorations and so I want to do like a bunch of cute sweet treats and like candies and desserts and things like that tree with so one of the things that i wanted to do was a little cupcake and that's what we have right here isn't it so cute this is like literally the cutest little thing and i'm gonna make a whole bunch of more but i wanted to show you guys how i made it in case you guys wanted to do a candy land theme for your christmas tree too the things that i used to make this was super affordable most of the stuff i got supplies wise i got at dollar trees it's like a glittery sprinkle cupcake with a cute little cherry on top. It has like a little ornament hanger right here from the tree. Second one here on the side, which is what I might do so that it's a little bit more stable. So make sure you guys stay tuned and watch the whole video to see how we made these cute cupcake ornaments. Okay, so here are the supplies you're going to need to make these. First things first, we have a bag of cotton balls i got these at dollar tree for a dollar you just need like a pack of 100 you don't even need the whole pack next you're gonna need these little sunday cups i got these in the party section i also got these at dollar tree they come in a pack of six so that's what we'll be using for the base of the cupcake and then next we're going to need a plastic baggie glitter vase filler that you can also get at Dollar Tree. I got the white and silver ones, but if you can find colored ones like pink ones, then you don't need the plastic baggie. I'll explain that later. But you're also going to need a pair of gloves, a piece of paper. If you have like a paper plate, that works like a little better, but I just had paper. And then you're going to need a hot glue gun, hot glue sticks. Get a large pack, like a hundred pack or something like that, because you're going to need a lot. Paper towels. Some ornament hooks, you can get these at Dollar Tree. You get 200 for a dollar, so it's a really good deal. Some glitter. This is just some chunky craft glitter that I got at Walmart. It's just like this really cute light blue color. Or other colors too, but I really like this color. And then you're just going to need some acrylic paint. This was just some paint I already had here in the house. Okay, let's get started. So we're gonna be using these little party Sunday cups and those are gonna be the base of the cupcake. I'm just gonna take a small piece of paper towel and I'm just gonna like scrunch that up and I'm going to hot glue that to the inside bottom base of our cup here. And this is gonna like add some more stability to the cup. It's gonna make the base actually have some weight to it. So I'm just going to glue the bottom base and parts of the sides kind of good enough amount to actually make it stay. And then I'm just going to scrunch up the paper towel and place that inside where all the glue is at. And then you're going to want to take the glue gun again and kind of hot glue the paper towel to itself so it becomes like more compact and it's not just have free spaces all over the place. Once you have that base ready to go, we can get a handful of cotton balls and you're just going to take them and you're going to try to stretch them out. Be very delicate about this, like you're not trying to rip it, but you're basically trying to fluff them out as much as possible without necessarily like ripping it. So your, your final little piece is going to look like this and it looks so fluffy, two or three times as big as what the original compacted cotton ball looks like. So I'm just delicately pulling at its side while also pulling on the other side. Just to make them all nice and fluffy. So this is going to give our icing effect for our cupcake. And I'm just going to keep doing this for the rest of our cotton ball pieces here. Oh, 
Once we're done with all that, we're going to grab our ornament hooks and we're just going to take one and we're going to puncture a hole into the side of the cup. Now, these are kind of flimsy. They're kind of like really thin paper clips in a way. So if you don't want to deal with this hassle, you can just grab a pin and puncture a hole through it. But I was able to get it through one of these. And then you're just going to bend it so that it hooks all the way through and comes around together. Now disclaimer, you're going to want to do this on both sides of the cups. If you don't, you're going to end up trying to hang it like this and all the weight's going to cause the cupcake to hang sideways. So just go ahead and put two ornament hooks, one on each side, and that way you can hang the cupcake standing upwards on the tree. Now I'm just going to take the glue gun again and I'm going to hot glue the rim part of the cupcake. And we're just going to put our first fluffy piece right there onto the rim. And we're just going to repeat that for the rest of the pieces to go around the perimeter of the top of the cup. And while you're doing that, you're also going to glue each piece of fluff to each other so that it becomes a singular combined layer. Just be careful as you're placing the fluff pieces onto each other, the hot glue will spread pretty quickly if you're pressing too firmly. So you wanna lightly press them onto each other and they'll just start to stick on their own as long as they come in contact with the glue. And this is what our first layer looks like when it's all done. And we're just going to keep going in with the hot glue gun and adding more fluff pieces on top of each other. That way it kind of adds more volume to the top of the cupcake. And after you get the desired fluffiness that you like, you would get something that looks like this. Now this next step is going to be optional. If you were able to find that glitter vase filler in pink, then you don't need to do this. But if you couldn't find it in pink like I couldn't, then you can just take your acrylic paint and we're basically just going to paint the little vase filler balls. And we're going to place them into a plastic bag and we are just going to create a paint bath so that we can coat the outside of the balls. We're just going to squeeze a little bit of the acrylic paint into the plastic bag. I'm going to add a little bit of water into it and create our little paint bath. And you're just going to seal that up and basically scrunch them around shake them up into the bag so that the paint evenly coats all of the balls together. After I'm done with that, I'm just going to set this to the side and we're going to work on the next step while those are kind of like sitting in the paint. We're going to grab our cupcake again. We're going to take our piece of paper and we're going to get our glitter. And what we're going to do here is we're going to take our hot glue gun and we're going to create a spiral effect that's going to circle around the top of the cupcake. And we're going to do that in several little swirls back to back. Then you're going to take your glitter and you're going to sprinkle it on top of the hot glue. Do this over the paper so that the excess glitter falls over onto the paper and try not to make a huge mess. But you're going to lightly sprinkle it onto the hot glue. Then you're going to lightly tap the sides of the cupcake and allow the extra excess sprinkles 
to fall off onto your piece of paper. And you're just gonna go back in again and repeat this exact same process until you're finished with the whole thing. And after we're that, we're gonna get our gloves back out and we're gonna put them on. And we are just gonna grab one of those little base filler balls out of our bag of paint that we have here. Now you can leave them in the bag like I did here in the video or you can take them out and just set them on a piece of paper and allow them to dry. But if you leave them in the bag, they're gonna be still wet. So that's why you still need the gloves. Add some hot glue to the very top and you're just gonna place your little base filler ball on top of that pile of glue and there you have it you have your cute little cupcake ornament And here are the rest of the cupcakes that I made. I ended up made these cute pink sparkle ones as well. But you can do these with whatever color glitter that you have. I just think the pastel colors look the best. And yeah, this is the final result. That's it for today's video. If you guys like this content or you guys want to see more DIY projects or you guys want to see more art stuff, make sure you hit the subscribe button and let me know what you guys think in the comments. I have a whole bunch more cute little... DIY projects that I want to do for Christmas so I'm going to try to get a lot of those videos out for you guys but in the meantime I just want to say thank you so much for watching see you guys in my next video bye